Lionel Messi was offered a luxurious house, which could be the absolute top choice not only among football stars, but also among the world's famous celebrities. Hi everyone, today on the Inside Football Channel we are gonna talk about the mansion, which has already been called Lionel Messi's Dream Mansion. Besides, we'll also talk about other no less impressive houses in the GOAT's life. Support this video with your like if you are a Messi fan and let's get started! Are you ready? Lionel Messi is doing great in Miami. He has already won the first ever club trophy with Inter, while Leo himself and his family are more often seen smiling and being truly happy. Everyone knows that the GO took care of housing in Miami in advance by buying the entire ninth floor of the luxury residential complex Porsche Design Tower. We will leave you a link to the video in which we had a closer look at this complex and how Messi lives in it. There was also the option with the possible rental of a beautiful house located by the Atlantic Ocean in the Key Biscogne area. We also made a separate video about this one, there will definitely be a link to that. Eventually, everything came down to Lionel and Antonella deciding to look for a new home in Miami, choosing to find the perfect stay for their noisy family. On August 2nd, the Sun newspaper published an article with the following description of their next possible property. The house is situated in the prestigious Baca Rotten region that sits an hour to the north of Miami, but only 25 minutes minutes from Drive Pink Stadium in Fort Lauderdale. According to the source, Leo and Anto are satisfied with it and there is a high possibility that they can either buy it or rent it to live there for a while. But there is a more interesting option to consider, a much more interesting option. Architect Jorge Luis Vélez has developed a special model of a conceptual residence for the seven-time Ballon d'Or winner, which can be safely called Lionel Messi's dream mansion. The scale and beauty of the whole project is simply unbelievable. Seems like all possible and impossible conveniences are taken into account. The conceptual architectural project of the Messi Mansion in Miami is a work inspired by Lionel Messi's brand logo with its iconic M shape clearly visible from an aerial view. This majestic mansion consists of three levels and is located on an exclusive ship-shaped island, providing privacy and a privileged location. The property is designed with luxury and comfort in mind, with a wide range of amenities to enjoy. Outside, the large swimming pools stand out, perfect for relaxing and enjoying the tropical climate of Miami. In addition, it has a large pier that allows access to yachts and other vessels, offering a first-class maritime experience. Jorge Vélez presents his idea. For motoring enthusiasts, the mansion features an impressive deluxe car garage, while the garden deck provides a serene and natural space to relax in the fresh air. Inside the mansion, there is no shortage of entertainment options. Game rooms and an elegant party room are included, where residents can enjoy unforgettable moments. Additionally, a home theater offers a luxurious movie experience without leaving the property. One of the highlights of the project are the three helipads, which offer a convenient and exclusive form of air transportation to and from the mansion. For those who value panoramic views, the property offers stunning 360-degree views of the surrounding maritime landscape, providing an unparalleled connection to the beauty of Miami coastline. Now this is the description, this is the offer, an offer you can't refuse if you have enough money. By the way, what about money? The implementation of this amazing project will cost approximately $50 million. And thus, we have the following question for you. If you were Leo Messi, would you give $50 million to architect Jorge Vélez for the implementation of this incredible project? Write in the comments below. By the way, critics have visited the comment section under the architect's post and here's what they wrote about the project as a whole. The house and the concept are very nice, but 0% feasible. It would cause irreplaceable damage to the ecosystem that live there. Continuous waste expelled by man into the sea, both in its construction stage and later in the exploitation by the client. I suppose the cars are only decorative for obvious reasons. First, because they don't have a road to drive on. Second, the salt Peter of the sea would
would destroy them or many of the elements and parts that compelled them. In Miami, the hurricane season lasts five months, and therefore, there are many possibilities of being affected by these natural phenomena, which is the most aggressive in this area of Florida. Although there are others such as the rise of the tide, tropical storms, and the aggressive marine saltpeter. The location would also imply a cost of materials and equipment 10 times greater than building it on land. Materials must be resistant to saltpeter and anti-corrosive from the structure to the furniture and carpentry to be used, as well as the ceilings and windows must be resistant to ultraviolet rays that do not allow the constant insistence of these inside. In addition to hiring experienced labor for this, the expenses would be enormous. The design is very beautiful and the concept is quite modern, but I hope I never get to this by going over many problems that the world has. Thanks for the creativity and for showing us how new the human mind can be. And that's how it is, folks. The concept sounds intriguing on paper, but is very expensive and problematic in reality. Even if Messi would reject the idea of spending such a huge amount of money on these incredible projects, the very fact of such an offer displays the greatness of Lionel's personality. Clutch Points Beliefs The house's concept aligns with Messi's legacy and his current chapter with Inter Miami. Despite the ambitious design, the cost is reportedly estimated at a staggering $50 million, a figure that reflects both the uniqueness of the project and Messi's astronomical earning power. As Messi continues to make waves in the United States, his on-field prowess is complemented by the charm of this particular potential dream home. Although the immediate future may not see Messi residing in this futuristic mansion, the concept serves as a testament to his global impact and the exciting possibilities that lie ahead for him and his family at Incha Miami, both on the field and in the realm of the extraordinary. Alright, we are now moving on to other impressive real estate projects in Lionel Messi's life. The dream mansion looks stunning indeed, but Messi is already used to this kind of big planning. During the time of his performance for Barcelona, the concept of the so-called soccer ball-shaped house was very popular, being presented to an unaware audience as the house in which Messi's family lives. In fact, it was the same case of a project waiting for its implementation. The architect of this miracle is Luis Garrido. Some sources report that it was agreed with La Pulga himself. This project was called 10 Echo House, and the building cost was estimated at 7 million euros. So, what are all the hidden meanings behind the design of the 10 Echo House besides it being shaped like a football? The name 10 is Messi's famous t shirt number 10, which he has played in for FC Barcelona and his home country Argentina. From a bird's eye, you can see how the roof of the garages is in the shape of the number 1 and the pathway to the house provides the space needed to create the imagery of the number 10. Notes the Suit Life publication. The roof of the house is health-mirrored glass and health green glass. The glass allows natural light to come through. After all, this is an eco-friendly home. It's also divided into a hexagonal shape to reinforce the imagery of a football. And of course, the pool. What kind of celebrity house goes without a swimming pool? Just behind the house, Messi would just have to take a step off his wooden deck and he is in his marble-floored pool. You must be wondering why it's so big. That's because Garrido wanted to also replicate a football pitch. One half of the pitch Pitch is the swimming pool and the other part of the pitch is the grass. How was this wonder house supposed to look like inside? Only an architect's plan is available. Living in a giant football is probably an interesting experience to go through, but Messi and Antonella decided not to bring this creative idea to life, leaving the architect Luis Garrido with no money. It's a pity that the construction of this house got eventually scrapped. This could have been one of the coolest football houses in the entire world. Perhaps the coolest, which could only be surpassed by the possible future house Leo Messi will have in Miami. Guys, we hope you enjoyed this video, so be sure to give it a like and subscribe to our channel to watch more quality videos about top football and Lionel Messi, of course. Check out other suggested videos about La Pulga's life and houses and stay tuned for more content. It was Inside Football. We watch football from a different angle. Have a nice one and see you in a bit!